All right, dudes, I got a quick one for you today. A lot of people ask me how I do my um, overhead messages above my character. So it tells me like when my hamstring's on, when my hamstring's off, when I'm tracking someone nearby, all sorts of stuff like that. So I'm just going to kind of show you. I'll make a couple for this character so you can see how I do it. And uh, from there, you should be able to make all your own once you understand the process. So uh, just pull up Razor. The first one I'm going to do is going to be for hamstring because I like knowing when my hamstrings turn on and off on a character that has hamstring. All right, so first thing you want to do is just go into game and toggle your hamstring on and off so you can see the, the system message that we're looking for, that we want to we want to use that message to, to have Razor make a message over our head. So I toggle my hamstring on. You will now attempt to hamstring your opponents down here in the bottom left. Toggle it off. You refrain from making hamstring attempts. So that's the system message we want Razor to look for. So I crack open Razor, Options, Speech and Messages, Show Overhead Messages, have that checked. Type in the message. You will now attempt to hamstring your opponents. And I want to set overhead message. Message to be displayed. Ham on. Okay. So now message is ham on. I want to set that color so that my ham is on. Selecting game. I want green. I want ham on to be green. Okay. So now when I toggle my hamstring on, it should show me ham on. Sweet. Okay. So now for turning it off, you refrain from making hamstring attempts. So I go back into overhead messages. New one. You refrain from making hamstring attempts, period. Set overhead message. Message to be displayed. Ham off. OK. Set the color of that bad boy. Since my ham is going off, I want it red so I know it stopped. Stop my hams. All right, so now when I toggle my ham on and off, there it goes. On and off all day. Overhead message. Also, sometimes sometimes this uh, doesn't save, so just make sure you save your profile after you make changes. All right, next, uh, another one is enemies nearby. So to do this, uh, let's get in my system log. Let's see what the message is when I track someone. So I probably won't track a red right now. may not even track other players just being here. So I'm just going to set it to all players and uh, no filters to see if I get anyone. Begin hunting. There you go. So that's the message I'm looking for. Now tracking double dot. You don't want to go further than that because it's because you you need a generic. So anytime now tracking pops up, doesn't matter the person's name. I want it to show up. I want Razor to pick it up. So options, show overhead messages. The message I'm looking for is now tracking. Set overhead message. Enemy nearby. Set color hue. If there's an enemy nearby, I would like a orange message to tell me that. Okay? So now let's test. There you go. Enemy nearby popping up over my head while I'm hunting. So now anytime my track picks up a murderer, it will alert me that there's an enemy nearby. Look at that. All right, dudes. That's about it. That's all it takes to set overhead messages. So I hope this helps you in game. Take it easy, and uh, have a great week. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button.